rest of the door. Now, um, am I on like a speakerphone or do you have headset in? Um, I'm actually on my phone right now. Um, I probably won't be able to talk on computer through headset until I get my computer fixed. Gotcha. Um, so am I on like a speakerphone kind of thing? Yeah, yeah. Xbox, Over turn here. off. No. <laughs> you actually did it. <laughs> did, it, did it do it? Yeah. Oh no, oh no, I'm so sorry. <laughs> did it log you out? No, it completely shut off my Xbox. Really? No, no, yeah. no, 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 no. Oh, 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 I was just playing. I'm going to do a check thing. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> this video just got a lot <laughs> cooler. <laughs> oh no. Hey guys, my name is Zayde and welcome to uh, Lumber Tycoon. Today's episode's looking a little bit different, and we're also joined by a special guest. Hey, I'm Sixpex. What's up, dude? <laughs> How you doing, man? Oh I'm my good. god. So, I'm doing pretty good, actually. So, guys, as some of you guys may know, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to insert a uh, a clip into uh, this video, like probably towards the end. Uh, <laughs> he was on Code Primates, one of Code Primates' videos. That's actually how I first seen this base. Oh man, I just seen a preview of it. I don't want to look yet. But he also did manage to. So I just want to really quick give him a bunch of credit for helping me out. This dude literally clutched up, cleaned up my base for me. So thank you so much for that, dude. I really owe it to you. Um, I'm taking a look at what he did. Oh. <gasps> what? I couldn't really get to look at the photos you sent me. On Discord. Oh my god, my first axe, my first ever axe for this base is right in the back. That is so cool. Oh my god. Dude, this is so sick. Oh. So, Denver, you could you could change the design and put this somewhere else if you want. No, it's staying right here. Whatever you built, it's staying where it is. Dude, the oh my god. The amber axes are all oh my lord. Wait, what else did you do? Look over by the shop in the corner. <gasps> oh my god! Oh! Holy sh... Oh, I don't want to say that in this video. But, oh! Hi. Oh my... Good... Dude. Oh my god, this is so sick. Let me... Bro, if I could just... Here, let me dab you up. <laughs> <laughs> this is... Oh, wow. Dude, I'm speechless. Oh, you got a nice little relic. Dude, th this is so much better. Sorry, 59. Um, who he's the guy that built me the storage unit. But sorry, bro. It just needed to go. I needed I need to make it look a little more clean. Well, this guy right here, guys, he did all the work. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put him link in the description. Also, thank you guys for 50 subscribers. So this will actually be the 50 subscriber special. Um. Oh. <laughs> I only started this channel like a week ago, and one of my videos just got a uh, thousand views today, and I'm very happy about that. So thank you guys for all the love and support. Now, Congrats, huh? thank you, man. I appreciate it. Um, so wait, what else is uh, different? Uh, I well, I added the back doors. I'm pretty sure you already seen. Yeah, the back uh, doors. There's a bunch of boxed furniture. I got rid of oh. like just the lamps because I didn't have any tables, but this I is put actually... down everything else. Oh, dude, this it's is so like a waiting, cool. It's like a waiting lobby. Dude, this is it's beautiful. Warming. Oh, my. Dude, I actually really, really enjoy this. Like, the look of this is insane. I was actually stressing the other day, what do I do for a back door? Now, obviously, you can't really see the best. It's that time of the year. But I definitely... I definitely should put... Um... What's it called around here? Uh, floodlights all around the bottom part of the base. I feel like that would look really, really cool. And oh my god, you have a ladder right here. I mean, at end times, that looks so beasty. So I could just climb up here, take a look. Oh my it's god, than dude, you put ledges, like edges, ledges, whatever you call them. Uh, just call them 
ledge. ledge. A I ledge, yeah. This is cool. And then I can... Wait, if I get on top of the ledge, I can just... Oh, this is so cool. Dude, you did... Oh, wait, wait, wait. What did you do to my son? <gasps> oh, my God. Dude, that looks so much better. That looks... I could make it look better, but... That's the best I have for the moment. D dude, it's perfect. This is literally... Oh, my God. Do you know how long I struggled to get this? Good God. Oh my God, I can climb up my own side. <laughs> oh, dude. But yeah, guys, the base is coming together pretty well. Now, I do apologize for some of the visual uh, downsides. Let me see if I turn down my graph. Oh, that just makes it 10 times worse. Okay. So, um, what else did I miss? Oh my God. Uh, replace all your one by ones with these. <laughs> this is great. Yeah, these are gonna it's come lovely. super big, handy. Like yeah, instead of tiny one by ones, you could actually just chop a piece off. And I could yeah, I could literally belt. just come over here, start cutting. Obviously, I'm not going to right now, but like the zombie wood too. Oh man, I remember struggling to try and get one of these pieces, man, because there was like nobody that had them, and the, they patched the original modding wood glitch. But uh, you two sawmills. Yeah, 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 the 238, like, place it in with each other. Any of my oh, yeah. OG lumber players from, like, 2016 and 20... Was it in 2016? Or 2017? It didn't have to be 238, by the way. You could have just done double max playing time. Yeah, but it looked cooler. That's what I always did. <laughs> just yeah. make sure it worked. But anyway, guys. The... Oh, man, look, he did some of the uh, trim. This trim actually looks so sick man like you are killing it wow uh, so i tried to match up with the original look but the end yeah. times trim didn't exactly line up but that's okay dude it, it gives a character and i actually really really appreciate that so yeah guys please if you guys want to see more videos of me and uh six picks together definitely let me know down below but guys the moment you've all been waiting for. Again, I apologize. It's really not the best visual. Um, but yeah, guys. Welcome to the Lumber King's base. <laughs> so, um, if any of you guys watch Code Primate, you guys probably know. Here, let, let's try it again. Let's see if it works. Xbox, turn off. Not anymore. I'm on computer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was so great. Awesome. So yeah, that was probably the best troll ever on lumber. Th that was so smart. That stayed in the history books for sure, and that always will. So speaking of which, I got a signature over here. Oh yeah, I do remember seeing this off camera, which is super cool. Super cool. So he's got Code Primate signature all right here. He's got the Code Primate axe that Code gave him. What is this painting right here exactly? Uh, that's actually just kind of random. I just stuck that up there. I actually like that. I thought, oh wow, this is cool. That's when he added the paintings at first. I was going to put the B axe in here, and yeah. these two tables, fill the in between with glass, but I kind of just changed against the idea. Huh. Text my friends a man. Cone torch. So, wait, did you, um,. For this Halloween, did you just add like little Halloween decorations to kind of like make it stand out a little bit? I actually added those, I think, one or two years ago. I don't. Oh, remember. dude, those those are sick. This is awesome. So, oh my God, where do we start? This base is. Oh man, wait, is this oh. your original sign over here? Yeah. Wow. Piece of history right here, man. Heads. Uh, noob heads, pumpkins. That's pretty cool. Okay, take me. Dude, where do we start? Uh, let's start with the bottom floor. Okay, so, perfect. Over here, we got all the sorting. Not much has changed on the sorting, honestly, since uh, Code's video. I've been slacking on this base <laughs> because I have another one in the works. Yeah, guys, I'm not gonna lie to you. Do you, do you mind if I give a tiny spoiler alert? I don't mind. It's pretty beasty, guys. I've seen it, and I will tell you guys, it is insane. You think this base is cool that you guys have seen? Wait till you see his new base, man. Congrats on that, by the way. This this is beautiful. <laughs> yeah. 
uh, okay. this thing, you put the wood up, the wood detector detects the wood, okay. and at the same time it detects the wood, it sends a signal to a specific wood pipe oh. based on the wood detector. So you'll know if the wood gets passed through. If it doesn't show up, it just falls back at the front of the base, or... Yeah. And one of the... Actually, I don't think the glass... The glass one works. That was originally intended for extras, but... Oh. I never made it work. <laughs> it's so cool looking, though. You could just open it up, store a couple pieces of wood in there, you know? Uh, wow. There's so it's much going on. This is just a... I think this is an original modern... No, it's not. I just have a patch on there for fun. I know these these sawmills are doubled. Mm. Well, they were. So, what is your theory on? I I just have to ask a couple questions because I've never actually gotten to actually like speak with you. So this is actually my first time voice to voice with him on a call, and I just gotta ask. How do you feel that this was added into the game? Do you think it... Would you agree with me it was added to kind of, like, isolate the modded wood glitch? Um... Maybe, maybe not. I would... I think it was added simply because, like, some pieces of wood were too long for the shorter version. Hmm. So this helped out with some tree logs that you couldn't fit entirely in. There are still pieces of wood like say fire logs that you can't actually fit in the sawmill. I've noticed that, so yes. If he maybe made the sides bigger or wider. Or he made a saw max of three. Hmm. That'd be really interesting. Same thing as the bigger entrance. That'd be yeah. really useful. It would be for sure. I highly agree with that man. Alright. So if you want to continue uh take the show away man there's so much, so I'm having sensory overload over here. <laughs> All right, well, we'll start with somewhere small. Okay. This is uh, kind of a little storage area. This okay. used to be a shop a long time ago. Here is the axe vault. Let me open the door real quick. You can only open it from the inside. Okay. Oh, wow. So he's got... What do you got? You got candy cane, amber, Twitter axe, which you guys can't get no more. And RIP the Twitter name. <laughs> Um, Maniax, Alpha, he's got some of the classics right here, basic hatchets, probably bought from the store, um, the Rookery, oh man, this dude's got, like, almost everything you could ever imagine possible. Everybody used to throw away their silver axes once they got a, uh, present axe, yeah, call them, or gift axes, so I'd usually just take them and give them to new players. Well, that's super helpful. But, yeah. I don't know why they just throw them away. They're good. I'm coming out right now. <laughs> that's about it for this area. Okay. You come over here on the left side of that. Oh, what? You'll find my old gift storage. Just oh, a bunch so you of got... little knickknacks in there. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, my God. Dude's got cold was... gifts. <laughs> this was sorted neatly, but I don't know what happened. I don't know. There was... They get more native blue through here. <laughs> Oh man, this is insane. Oh yeah, I forgot about those pieces. Zombie, Sinister. fire. Wow. We got some gray wood blueprints. Wait, where do you have those? It's over here. Oh, they're over here. I have another one out there too. Oh my god. Yeah, don't ever move those, man. Because if, even if you move them now, they're gone. They'll disappear. Really? Yeah, man, don't try it. <laughs> I'll try oh. it with this one out here. <gasps> oh no. You're going to lose it, man. Yeah. I have an extra, I don't know what to do with it. Okay. Oh, that's so cool. Rest in peace. Yep, it's gone. Yeah. Yep. That's so sad. Oh. Oh, well. Fuck, they removed it. At least <laughs> I have history. Yeah, exactly. You got a piece of history with your base, man. This whole base is something super special. This is... Uh, Over oh, here so is just a little way up. Instead of the elevator... The, the space was too laggy for that, so I decided to remove it. Wait a minute, wait a and minute, wait a minute. You made an elevator. Yeah. How did you get up? You can see it in Code's video. Oh, you just jump. You just jump and go backwards. Now you're on the second. Oh! I didn't 
do much other than move out the elevator and get rid of the wall that was covering the area where all the wires were. Oh, wow. Oh, what is this? Where are we? Uh, this is the garage floor. This is where I keep all my vehicles. Okay. And we got a little... And I don't even know what this room is. Just I've a room. haven't had plans for it. Yep, just oh, a room. I could just climb walls, too, if I want. We'll call yeah, this the prison room. Prison room. Go all prison realm. <laughs> oh, man. So let's check out this. So this is where you keep all your vehicles, I see. It's actually really yeah, clever. Yeah, I, I don't know too many people who keep their, their what, garage on the second floor. Yeah, I've actually... That rich people. Dude. I've actually thought of doing, like, a, a garage. Like, I have a garage. I think I'm just going to keep it the way it is. I just want to do a simple base. Never know. Season oh, 2. You could start would be sorted. Oh, okay, so... If there's any would be sorted. So it'll, you'll be able to watch from here. It's like a little factory point where you can view down. Yeah. Reminds you kind of like a, a metal factory where they grind the metal down, if that makes sense. But. Um. I was thinking of a welding, but it's grinding. Yeah, Gears like welding. Gears way up for cars and wood if I'm too lazy to walk it up myself. So what? You just place the cars on the conveyor so they ride up themselves? Uh, no. The cars can't do that, actually. It's only wood. Really? Yeah. Cars hmm. are, I think, too heavy for that. Or they just don't have the... The wheels don't have the mechanics that would do. Hmm. That's interesting. Here's just another way down or up. It's near oh, the okay. auditorium entrance. Ah. <laughs> Convenience in a base this size is a must-have. Oh, yeah, for sure. Space Otherwise, is taking massive. your foot around is going to be not a very fun time. <laughs> Okay, what do we got up here? Hey, look at my base! <laughs> here we got the screenshot chairs. I can't remember the last time we used these. Screenshot chair? Yeah, you just pop in here, pull out, zoom out. You got a full view of the base, pretty much. Is it that time? You can do it. Do we take one right now? Here we go. Three, two, one. Smile for the camera. And is, if you look in the crown, those two alpha axes, those are originally bought from the lumber store. Not Wait, in the crown? Above There's the K? Two alpha axes. Yeah. Oh my god. Dude, there's so many small details that like I would not notice just looking and glancing. Maybe I did notice and I, it just completely flew over my head. That Dude, that's so cool. This is oh yeah, beautiful. the door and the L actually works too. It just goes to the garage floor. There's just uh, oh my god. no way up or down. But over here to the left of the dance floor, we just got another way up for cars. Or you can walk up. Convenience oh is nice. So wait, this is a, you made a dance floor, man? <laughs> that is so cool. I would add more wires, but I think this would push the base over the data size limit. Wait, may I ask, what data size are you right now? Oh, man. So I think man. the PDF and rewiring the base would be my best option for saving data size. Yeah, I'll join with just you. Just so I could build more. There we go. I'm getting groovy with it. <laughs> and then just over here, we got another way up for cars. This is about as high as cars could go in the base currently. I don't think mm -hmm. I plan on building another ramp. But up then here, there's... Black codes video there was two trees i decided to go with this instead um i don't exactly know a house <laughs> a house a shrine it looks like a shrine man we'll call it we'll call it a shrine for kings but it's a house for a king it's like house on the hill kind of <laughs> yeah you get the best view oh yeah man yeah, the reason I said shrine is because, the, like, the Squidward paintings all lit up and, like, in an area, a specific area in the middle. <laughs> this is so cool, though. I love this. And then oh. just over either side is a hallway you could take up to the second story of this. Oh, there's a second story? Oh, man. I don't know how many stories there are total on this base. There's so much built on this, man. Wow. Dude, this is like a terrace, man. Like... Yeah, I don't even know what to call this. I Yeah, man. Oh, there's what? so many things that you've built and designed in such a special way, I feel like. This... Guys, this really is the Lumber King. I hate... Like, I'm sorry, Mummy McSpringy. We love your base. But I'd really like to get to tour your base. So if you're watching this, 
I don't even know if she's still on YouTube, but if you're watching this, I'd love to have you as a guest in our video. Or Seniac, if you're watching this, which I highly doubt he is. Even Code. I'd like to get Code in one of our videos sometime. Yeah, that'd, that'd be, be awesome. Cool. That would be. If we could yeah, all three of us. Up, he's based in person, so that'd be uh, a new for me. Oh, you've never seen his base? Uh, no. I think Mummy is the AD girl. Yeah. Uh, yeah, she, I believe her name, Mummy McSpringy, is because she's a mom, I would assume. That's what I've always got at it, but I'm not entirely sure. That's one way to look at it. You can jump down if you want, just don't break your legs and fall. <laughs> I might. <laughs> oh, my leg. <laughs> that Spongebob reference, my leg! Over here, this looks like, what, smooth walls? Uh, they're just wedges. Oh my. I can't really tell, the visual is hard to see. <laughs> that was a pain to figure out. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah, like I could see like everything, like large floor. Like some of the stuff that he built out of. This is just so special, guys. You guys have no clue, man. Up here, the final story. I was going to build a skyscraper, but I kind of put a hold on that idea as soon as data size started ramping up. <laughs> I'm building a, a lighthouse. Gonna build it. Oh. I was gonna build it way high. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god, man. This is. Just a little bit. This is insane. Just this alone sent my base up a data size, so I got a little worried. Wait, for the. because of the glass panes? Yeah. Oh, wow. That is crazy, man. As you can see, I needed a little, just a little bit. So is that why you kind of like gave up? I wouldn't say gave up, but like, just like, eh. Yeah, I just kind of stopped on this one. Plus, I mean, the design is a little outdated. There's better designs right now for bases. Which his new design for his next base, guys. I promise you. <laughs> This guy really has helped me out, and it's it's Lumber King. You guys need to just go show some support. But um, yeah. I promise you guys, his second base will be worth it. Would you agree? Um, that's up to the viewer. When they see it, very they true. can hate it or they can love it. But hate is love at the end of the day. Remember that. <laughs> oh yeah, man. So is that it? Is that all we're toward? Uh, just about. All right. I can't think of anything else. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Well, uh, do you wanna you wanna end it off here? Yeah. Hey, Alrighty. Thank you for watching Anxiety's videos, and um, <laughs> make sure to like and subscribe. Comment down below what you think, and uh, if you guys need any advice on building, I'm happy to help out. We should support our builders in our community. For sure, 100% agree. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys really enjoyed. Go show some love to his channel as well. <laughs> and let's roll the outro.